hi it's your girl Korewa. welcome to the channel so if it's been a while since you traveled to or from Ghana or if it's your first time traveling to Ghana or from Ghana and you were wondering what the new airport looks like or if you're feeling homesick and just want to see what's going on in Ghana and what's all the hype about the new airport is like and this is the video for you today I'm going to be your tour guide take you to Ghana Kutuka International Airport so let's go yeah you take your car so this is what it looks like and you ride off into the sunset hopefully and have some fun in ghana until it's time for you to come back and depart so departures so this is the terminal three departures this is where all the international flights take off from and i personally feel that departures is pretty cool uh, it's much better than arrivals there's a lot more to see so this is you walking into the departures and the cool thing about departures the ghana departures now is you can go with whoever came to see you off it's not like before where you had to part ways at you know the front um, entrance now you can all go in check in together with your family um so they've got these screens there where you can look to see where your um uh flight checking is 
and that's what it looks like on the inside you yeah so these are the screens that tells you which you know um, section you're going to in this case I was flying on Kenya Airways and so this is where Kenya Airways was you join the queue and oh it's so beautiful and bustling in there it's just a really nice feeling to see all of you know the other well if you're Ghanaian to see all of the other Ghanaians and it's just really different from what we were used to in the past and it's a good feeling in here we've got um there are restaurants there there are shops there where uh, you can buy gifts and stuff like that we've also got the um, bag wrapping area you know where you can they, they wrap your suitcases um, in this cling film sort of thingy um what else yes there's everything that you would meet in any other airport there and after you've checked in upstairs here this is still in the departures hall is the food court so if you have some time to kill you can go up here with your family your friends that are uh, seeing you off and from up here this is the view a partial view from up there you can see down there that's the departure hall and you can enter up here so this is the food court where they've got uh, you've got a bathroom here so toilet facilities up here you've got shops where you can buy last minute things like if you've got some gifts or you know stuff you you need to buy they've got eateries and small uh, fast food restaurants up here you can sit and eat and talk um, with your family and if you're going to share tears this is probably where you would do that and here yeah, a couple of shops with uh, souvenirs and gifts and just anything Ghanaian anything African you can get up here uh, that second shop is Nalan they sell they've got really nice clothes there yeah and then that's that so after you shed your tears you come back down and then you go through passport control you can see passport control there in the picture and um, the cool thing about this place is they've got this e-gate system where you would tap your boarding pass and then it will let you through it's really cool but uh, so from this point your family this is where you have to say goodbye to your family and then you go on to immigration you know passport control um, uh, would be here then after that you do security and then obviously you come to your boarding gate so when you're looking for your boarding gate you've got all of these beautiful shops I'm telling you it's not even funny it's just gorgeous can even have a massage as you can see uh, there's more clothing there's a lot this is the sort of uh, what do you call it the duty-free section they've got lots of beautiful shops you've still got some eateries restaurants up here they've got um, some lounges so if you are in transit you can see the eatery over there if you're in transit they've got some lounges and if you can afford it you can go there and relax if not you can just look around the shops get some beautiful um, artifacts can take cloth beads it's just amazing or you can just sit down in one of the eateries and relax uh, and have something to eat um, yeah so here we're heading down I believe that our boarding gate was C7 so yeah we're just heading for C7 which was our boarding gate for that day you can see C6 there so the next boarding gate that's C7 so once you get to the boarding gate uh, and boarding starts um, you just once again walk through the aero bridge so that's C7 in the corner and then once uh, boarding starts you just walk through this aero bridge and you don't have to take the bus like you know was the case in the past in the past you just walk through here and it takes you straight um, to the aircraft just like uh, it happens in other airports around the world so you can see they're going through the aero bridge um, to 
the aircraft so that's the aircraft there that's the entrance to the aircraft where the lovely um, crew members would welcome you aboard so that's the entrance of the aircraft remember we are in Ghana Ghana yeah so that was it uh, boarding the aircraft and looking for your seat not rich yet so going through to economy but once you're settled in the seat and you look outside um, your window uh, from inside the airplane this is the view that you see it was a night flight obviously so this was the view um, you know from inside the aircraft and time comes and then you are off in the air this is always a sad part for me because um, you're leaving this beautiful country you don't know when you're coming back most of the time and you've left all of your family your friends business associates it's always a very emotional time for me but it's a beautiful airport and i hope you've enjoyed this tour i hope that you found it useful if you have please give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel and let's get talking in the comment section below um, this is ghana hopefully ghana can continue to keep developing keep getting stronger and yeah that's everybody's wish for ghana subscribe comment share like all of those good things and let's keep connected let's help boost ghana up it's up to me and it's up to you thank you for watching till the next video Ode mufwa, ode pe me wai Kebi bitch me wai Enfa hwe mufo nje hojo me wai I go maintain This boy no de complain No, they must skin pain If you ask then they no be explain Oh, and I met this baby yo Boy, he a different, watch him a kumo Odi ni do, he a remi fuo Everyone they call him kejo, I call him